At the time, back in January, police couldn't do anything about it because there was nothing technically illegal about it. The pictures were taken in public places, but now after a months long investigation and a new law on the books, police have made an arrest and a Maine mother is breathing a sigh of relief. My bubble was burst and I saw pictures taken very close of my daughter with me standing directly behind her. January 2018 at supermarkets and retail stores in central Maine, children were secretly photographed by a registered sex offender. Their parents would later discover the photos posted on social media. After having a total breakdown, I started spending hours just scrolling through anything I could find connected to him. Parents like Jessica Sproul, one of the first to speak out about it, and she was among the many who called Augusta police. At the time, though, there was nothing illegal about it. And not fun for us to hear as parents. To fight back, a Facebook group of parents formed. Hashtag time for a change. The bill is about protecting our children from sex offenders. And Augusta representative Matt Pouliot wrote an emergency bill. By April, a new state law had been created, making the intentional photographing of a minor without a parent or guardian's consent by a registered sex offender a Class D crime. Meanwhile, a months long investigation was underway, and Thursday, police arrested 34 year old Robert Robinson, the same man they say was taking those secret photos and posting them online. He's charged with three counts of possession of sexually explicit material of a minor under 12 years of age. To know that they got it and they caught him and he's in jail is just, I, it's just such a sense of relief. Detectives from the Augusta Police Department say they got a search warrant and took it several, it took several months to comb through all the images on Robinson's social media accounts. Robinson's bail was set at $15,000 cash and he is being held at the Kennebec County Jail.